Hi everyone, I'm Kirby Johnson. I'm here with celebrity stylist Harry Josh, who was with Rose Byrne at the Emmys. He did her hair and he's gonna show us exactly how to get it at home. I certainly am. So Harry, how did you and Rose land on this look? You know, we were actually totally torn because we didn't know which, which direction to go, whether to be, keep it really simple or go really dramatic. And we were flipping through the internet one day and a picture of Bianca Jagger came out and she had a very similar dress to the dress that she actually wore. And she's like, what if we do something like that? Glamorous, 70s inspired, early 80s, kind of big wave. Her hair looked amazing and you're gonna show us how to get it at home, right? Absolutely, I mean, no, not everyone can have thick, gorgeous, amazing hair like Rose, but sure. I can certainly give everyone tips at home that can at least try to emulate it. Fake it till you make it. I say so too. <laughs> All right, to get the look, what you want to do is wash your hair, apply mousse to wet hair from root to tip, and then once you've done that, use a blow dryer and really aim the nozzle of the blow dryer into the roots all over the head to create a nice, full lift. So just aim it around the whole head, get all the body of the roots you want. Once you do that, put in your part where you'd like your hair to be parted. So when you start to curl, you want to take out a quarter of the section of the head. We're going to take out a small section, cut that in half, and we're just going to wrap the iron around it. Let it hold for about three seconds, drop it. Take the section right above that, mimic the exact same format, pull it all the way down, let it drop, and then comb it out. And as you comb it, you're gonna see this beautiful S formation happening. When that happens, place those plastic clips, anything you can do to kind of lock those ridges and waves into the hair and just keep them smooth. Once you've done that, work away your way around the whole head, let it sit for at least 10 minutes, take out the clips, brush it, and you're ready to go. So before we go, was there anything that you said to Rose before you sent her away in the car? Uh, yeah, I actually always try to give any client I work with on a red carpet just a few tips, whether to tuck, not to tuck. Be careful when you hug somebody who has sequins, because that stuff gets tough, the hair's <laughs> down, so there's always a lot of something. But for Rose specifically, all I told her before she gets out of the car, stick her hands under her nape of her neck and just give it a scratch and just slide it out. And what that does is just kind of lifts it all out and zhuzhes it and then she's ready to hit the red carpet. All right, Harry, thanks so much for showing us this at-home demo. Thank you. And now you guys know how to get Rose Burns Emmy's look.